Hi guys, welcome back to our channel and in today's video we are going to help you with CLF2 minus Lewis structure. So to determine this Lewis structure we will first need to find out the total number of valence electrons. Here we have one chlorine atom and two fluorine atoms. Um, both of these atoms have seven valence electrons in its outer shell and as there is a negative charge over here it indicates that it is accepting an additional electron to form this structure. So we are going to add that electron as well. And in total, we have 22 valence electrons for this ion. Place chlorine atom in the center and both the fluorine atoms around chlorine atom like this. To show a bond between these atoms, place a pair of electrons. So doing that, we will be using up 4 out of 22 valence electrons and we are still left with 18 more. Um, we will place 6 valence electrons around each fluorine atom so that these fluorine atoms can have complete octets. So 6 around this fluorine atom and the 6 electrons around this chlorine atom. We are now left with 6 more and um, we will first place 4 electrons on chlorine atom so that chlorine atom can have a complete octet but we are still left with 2 more valence electrons. These 2 electrons will be placed on the chlorine atom itself because it can accommodate more than 8 valence electrons. And now if we calculate the formal charges, you will come across a charge of minus 1 on this chlorine atom and that is fine because we have a minus charge over here. So this is the Lewis structure of ClF2 minus. Do not forget about putting brackets and mentioning charge because this is an ion. I hope this video helps you to understand this Lewis structure and for more such videos on Lewis structure, molecular geometry, polarity of the molecules, make sure to subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.